we're gonna do a video to show you now that you have printed out your digital um, pattern we're gonna show you how to assemble it again we're using Parker's pants um, as an example this one was released in um, March of 2020 and um, it has some special and new ways of how we are assembling so Generally, though, this is the same process that you're going to use for all of our digital patterns. This one just looks a little bit different. But the main thing that we want you to know when you, after you've printed your instructions, you'll go to a page that looks like this. It's got an assembly map that's laid out and shows you where everything's going and in the order of your pages. And so no matter which version or which pattern you're using from us, you will have a map. Um, and so right now we're gonna lay that out. The first thing to do is we've got to trim off um, our sides and you can do this any way you want to, but this is the way we would recommend um, is to trim off the right and the bottom because we are, most of our sheets line up left to right. Um, so you're just gonna trim off those portions. I'm doing a big set of chunk together. Um, so I'm, I'm just slicing across the right side and the bottom side. Then I'm going to take my pages and I'm going to look at my size here, my map, and I'm going to start lining up pages 12 and 13. And as you can see, again with this one, we have given you places to connect. You see this little spool symbol? Um, when you know you've connected correctly by putting page 13, because we did not cut off that section, putting it up underneath page 13, pardon me, page 12, you can see that you get a complete spool. So when you see that spool, you can also see that you're connecting your pattern pieces. Another spot to connect is here. You can see that this is letter A to A and letter E to E. So we're also, when you look at here, our next pattern pieces down are pages 16 and 17. So for now, I'm gonna set aside pages 14 and 15, and I'll come back to that. But while we're here, I'm gonna go ahead and complete, continue down these pants. These are the fronts of the pants. And as you can see, I continue to connect and you can spool to spool and you see another spool here and you see that the, those D's are connected to make that half circle, that spool is connected. Let me go ahead and put a piece of tape here to hold this in place. And you've got a completed spool on that side, completed spool on this side. And then you have in your center this completed E. So these are all measure markers here. I've also got my one inch square. That's what we talk about as our, um, the point that you need to take and you wanna measure to make sure that you have printed correctly. And I'm just putting my ruler on there to know that I'm scaled. So when I put all of these pieces together, I know that I am scaled correctly. This is the right size and I'll be ready to cut out my size three pants um, to make Parker's pants.